command has been given. From here onwards, the company will perform the entire drill without further demand. Ladies and gentlemen, you are now witnessing the changing colors, blue and white where the drillers in blue and white uniform interchanges their posts, signifying the position we have undergone through the Academy's character building training. The semi-regimented system eventually reconstructs and reinforces the 70-year-old civilian to a regimental man. The termination of the very first character map must embark in the class of 2007. From the moment we took our very first step to the high ground of the Academy, we became aware that survival is only for those people who carry with them enough stock of determination. MAP also knew to the class of 2011 that determination is always accompanied by a vision. We were taught to be determined not just in setting goals or visions, but also in taking charge, striving forward, going beyond our limits, and achieving what we have always wanted. what is actually signified by the formation now taking form before you, the big arrow, which shows that dead ahead to reaching this vision is the only direction the Alta Zian class will be taking. Determined to strive forward, we set our unabashed voyage to one common endeavor. Having experience to be the lowest level in the academy led us to acquire a gorgeous character. As cadets, we were expected to be polite at all times. And because of this expectation, we were used to greet every person, whether a stranger or not, as we passed by them. This led us to a realization that there is nothing better than a conversation started with a gorgeous citation. To a courteous act, we share the humble deeds embedded in our class, so that wherever we go, whatever we do, we tend to establish rapport to the people around us. As future seekers, this will provide us an assurance to work in a hostile, free atmosphere. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we share a sense of courteousness to the letters H and I. Hi. And a pleasant morning to all of you. We welcome you all to the Sonic Drill Exhibition of the Class of 2011. Loyalty. This has always been a strong foundation of any successful institution. Considering the fact that the subordinates do not only share the glorious facets of such institutions, but as well as bitter ones, make it enough to extend the furious wings of time. The amount of how much struggles and pains they share with such institution could be the basis of true loyalty. The class of 2011 is just on its way on proving its loyalty to the Academy. But its four years stay in the Academy has already provided the class with an impressive start. Now forming in front of you are the letters M, A, A, B, which connotes that the glorious year of 2011 is a true loyalty and a pledge that you will stand back to what our dear Academy has imparted on us. With this, we carry within our identity the traits of a mad cadet and we render a salute, committing our loyalty. Though we are being trained in a military-oriented system, the fear of God has always been a part of it. As human beings, we owe our very lives to Him, and it's just righteous to put His name above all. We would like to take this opportunity to praise and render our highest form of gratitude to the Almighty for the graces brought by the fragility of the morning winds, the hopeful rays of the afternoon sun, 
through the conquering streaks of light of the evening wooden storm. For the strength that keeps us going although compared with academic pressures, loneliness brought by the fact that we are miles away from the warm companion of our families. Mark makes us realize that in this kind of life we chose, the trust and faith to God is our greatest soul weapon. Now ladies and gentlemen, forming before you is a huge cross, which signifies that as future seafarers, serving God is of our primary duty. Change is the only permanent thing in this world. Thus, the Academy trained us to become versatile to accept change as part of our lives. Ladies and gentlemen, in front of you is the letter X, manipulated from the previous formation, which signifies the versatility of our character. Now watch as the trainers show you a rifle exhibition called The Exchange of Rifles. This test symbolizes the camaraderie we were able to develop as we unitedly stand to the test of time. We believe, as well as our dear Academy, that hard work and consistency is indispensable at any bit for excellence. We have always been encouraged not just to try, but to do our best in our every campaign. Such lies in the formation now taking form before you, the asterisk. The Maritime Academy of Asia and the Pacific emphasizes quality education in the courses it offers, which mainly are the Bachelor of Science in Marine Transportation, the Bachelor of Science in Marine Engineering, and the Bachelor of Science in Marine Transportation and Engineering. MOP injects an intensive learning process through a thorough exposure of its cadets to the theoretical and practical aspects of their respective courses. Well-experienced and competitive merchant marine officers facilitate the midshipmen's course training, imparting with them the experiences which they may find vital to the job of a merchant marine officer. MAA promotes academic as well as semi-regimental activities, which will ensure solidarity among the midshipmen. Such group activities enable midshipmen to abolish differences concerning not only to the course they took, but also to the racial distinctions. Right before your eyes are individuals, each of which belong to a distinctive origin, race, and culture, but volunteer themselves to be a part of an institution which sees beyond those. Now formed before you are two identical circles, symbolizing the unity among the midshipmen. The class of 2011 entered Moab carrying nothing but a dream and a vision. A dream of becoming world-class seafarers and a vision to lead the maritime industry. But for us to be able to fulfill such a vision, we must first be worthy enough to be called the Alcadian class of 2011. as the jewelers perform before you a rifle exhibition called The Planting of Rifles. This symbolizes the brotherhood half midshipmen inculcate in ourselves. The drill show the midshipmen planting rifles to the ground as the other awaits and catches it. One more time, the jewelers make a round signifying the readiness of an cadet to be trustworthy as well as to be trusted at all times, upholding the you watch my back, I watch yours principle. Keep an eye open as the drillers execute a rifle exhibition called The Passing of Rifles, symbolizing the willingness of every cadet to lead the hand at each other, no matter how small the help may be, thus making us learn to value every effort of a fellow midshipman. We all came from different regions of the country with different dialects, personalities, and characters. But these differences proved to be a test on how we could be molded to stand, not as individuals, but as a class. 
A indoctrination and orientation period was our first step to this 